what was the first rule the first rule is when two or more singular form of singular subject when we join it with and it takes the plural form of verb now the second rule is the rule number 2 when two singular nouns refer to the same thing or same person when two singular noun refers to the same person or same thing the verb must be singular okay and that's what we are going to do the rule number 2 rule number 2 the rule number 2 says what is the rule number 2 saying the rule number 2 says when two singular nouns when two when two singular nouns in two singular nouns okay when two singular noun refer refer to the same refer to the same person or thing same person or thing then what happened two singular nouns refer to the same person or thing something happens the verb must be in singular okay or thing the verb the verb must be in singular the verb the verb must be in singular must be in singular okay now i have examples for you to look at what are the examples my guide that's one person mentor so here we are referring to singular nouns but to this of the same person my guide my mentor both are same person so when you are referring to the same person the verb must be game must remain singular so my guide and mentor are my father no it has to be singular my guide and mentor s so we said singular nouns refer to the same person or same thing then the verb remain singular or we have to take a singular verb that's a first example let's look at it my guide my guide and mentor and mentor my guide and mentor and the verb here is is my father look at the verb is the verb we use here is singular is my dad or my father look at the rule the rule says when two singular nouns refer to the same person the guide and the mentor both are same person therefore what happened the verb must be singular my 
my guide and my mentor is my father okay now another example for you the poet and philosopher the poet the poet referring to the same person poet and philosopher the poet and the philosopher both are same so what the verb that will be dash dead you cannot say the poet and philosopher are dead no it refers to same person so as the verb here singular when we are referring to the same person poet is the same and philosopher both are same the verb remain singular and that's a rule too what was the first rule the first rule said when two or more singular subjects are joined by and what happens then it takes the verb will be plural tina and mina are friends john and peter are players so when you add two singular singular subject with and that mean two different persons are they and therefore the verb will be plural the second rule is when we refer when two singular nouns talking about the same person or same thing then the verb verb must be singular that's a rule number 2 now the rule number 3 what is the rule number 3 says when the definite article the is used before each of the two nouns then it means two distinct persons are there therefore the verb is in the plural let's look at that the third rule this is a rule number 2 and a rule number 3 what's the rule number 3 the rule number 3 says when the definite article when when the definite article definite article the is used the definite article the we are using the definite article the and the definite article the is used is used before before each before each of the two nouns then what happens when it means then it means then it means two distinct person then it then it mean two distinct two different person two distinct persons persons okay therefore now what happened therefore therefore the verb used is the verb used used as 
in the plural is in the the verb used is in the plural number in the plural number let's look at it very carefully look at the rule number 3 the definite article the is used before each of the two nouns then it means two distinct persons okay therefore the verb is used in the plural number let's look at the example i have here for you what's the example examples we have here let's look at it a it says the man and the woman two different people the man and the woman and the woman the is used article the is used these two are two different people the man and the woman the man and the woman then what happens the verb will be in plural number so you will say the man and the woman are you use the plural form of verb are fighting the man and the woman no were fighting the man and the woman were fighting here in the third rule the definite article the when we use before persons that mean there are two definite persons are there the man and the woman two distinct person then the plural form of verb is used okay so the man and the woman were fighting so here the verb changes next the beggar one more thing for you example the beggar the beggar and the rich man the beggar and the rich man again you have the beggar one person the rich man another per distinctive person so the beggar and the rich man are the plural form of verb are the beggar and the rich man are friends so we have done three rules so far in the agreement of the verb the first rule two or more singular subjects when you add and with it tina and mina mummy and daddy then what happens the verb will be in the plural form mummy and daddy are we coming home are waiting for us and the second rule it says when two singular nouns refer to the same person the guide and the mentor in this the verb will take the singular form the poet and the philosopher refers to the same person so the verb will be singular and the third rule says when the definite article the is used before the nouns so the man the woman there are two distinctive person then the verb has to be in the plural form the beggar and the rich man the beggar the rich man both are two distinctive person so we take the plural number r friends r so it all depends so now we have done three rules and we have more rules to go to